Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of the Champions Cup. Today it's PSV against Leicester City. Of course, the lights are beaming down this evening. So let's go straight to the ground. Here's your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Well, these two teams have already played, of course, on match day one. Now they are involved in this fixture in the Champions Cup match day two. Yeah, it's going to be an interesting one. Uh, I think there's improvements to be made from both sides from match day one, so let's see if they can achieve that. Leicester City hoping that they can reach the same heights again as they did in their away win against Crystal Palace. Well, they finished 4-2 and uh, good work all round. Settle for a draw here, actually. Line up for the home side. Karim Rekic plays with Nikola Izima Barra in the heart of the defence. Andres Guardado starts with Jorginho Wijnaldum in the centre of the park. Luke de Jong is the lone striker today. Let's have a look at the referee today. It's Heiner Schnitty. Day one and the action there, Alan, that we were privileged to see. And here we go in the Champions Cup, match day two. Opportunity here, got to be. The goal stands. And that's wonderful, wonderful technique to just feather it into the bottom right. Well, they want to see this again, this goal. He's into the challenge. This could be a chance. Here's the chance. And that's a brilliant goal. Well taken. And that's a two for him now in the game. And goodness me, he really is on top of his form and on top of the opposition. Coming up another look at it, Alan, that will show us something. to see us in a goal in with a chance he must have thought that he was going to get the glory at the end of a terrific run now i think after that his teammates were looking on just expecting him to put it away row it's a quick break got to be and they've got him to score here I don't know how much longer he can go on like this with his 100% record. What a day he's having. Everything he shoots at ends up in the back of the net. Yeah, talk about the Midas touch. He's got to enjoy it while it lasts. Well, let's take another look at the goal. Here's the cross. That's good defensive play from the cross. He's gone up for the header just too high. And it's all about timing in those situations and fractionally mistimed that header.
Here's the young. And he shoots. Just skimming the crossbar then. Chance for it. And here's the shot. Great save. It's their corner. over the bar. Yeah, there's not much room for error because he had to get it perfect and he couldn't quite manage it. Oh, he's through. He's in the clear. Goes for goal. Splendid goal here. And that's flown past the keeper before really he could react. A good look here again by the replay of the goal. It's a wonderful advantage at this stage. They lead by four goals to nil. The ref blows for the free kick. Well, that's a yellow card. Yeah, I don't think there's any choice there from the ref. That was an easy decision for the ref. Yeah, I think so. And it was a poor tackle. It was badly timed. for De Jong. Oh, it could be on. And he takes the shot. It's Luke De Jong. Well, it's a goal. It's a terrific goal for the new signing. No, we knew he was talented. We knew he was exciting and been able to show that at the first opportunity here. A goal from De Jong. And he knew exactly where the keeper was there. He knew he didn't have to hit it particularly hard, you know. Coming up, another look at it, Alan. That will show us something. Are tumbling out of this match 4 1. Row. And that whistle means it's time for a break. It's half time. Well, one way traffic in that first half, and it looks all done and dusted. It's hard to see the visitors blowing that big lead. Let's take a look back at the highlights from that first half, and then we'll be straight back to your commentary team for the rest of the match. Well, away we go for the second half, hoping it'll be a bit more even, to be honest. And hits it! Oh, a goal! They've got one back. Goal from Narsin. What a first time finish that is. Really did swing his boot at it. It's a goal worth looking at again, isn't it?
Oh, he oh, could be in. He's in the clear. Here's the chance. Now that will be a corner. And he's got the ball well to set his team on the front foot by intercepting. Luciano Nasi. In a goal. And in comes the header. And it's in! The header! Great goal! And the goal scored by the inside of the post. Well, when you get it that far in the corner, the keeper has no chance whatsoever. Well, they want to see this again, this goal. Terrific contest at 4-3. Rowe. Looking to win it back at this critical point. Here's the shot. Well, that... A game you really didn't want to stop, but it has stopped now as the final whistle has gone. But the final score is 4-3. Brilliant effort by the players to produce a match like this in these conditions. Yeah, not the best, pretty cold out there, but they made sure they kept running about and that led to a great spectacle. So it's full time with the final score, 4-3. I'll leave you with the full match highlights and until next time, I've been Jeff Stelling. What a brilliant goal.